Delight for Lava everybody, my name is Gabby and for those who don't know us, we work in the Canterbury region and I work in Timaru schools and Waimate schools. So I work at Waimate Centennial, Waimate Main, Makikihi, Bluestone, Ocean View and Timaru South School. Kia ora everybody, I'm Seddon, uh, I work at Burnside, Bishopdale, Northcote, Banford and St Bernadette schools. Guten Tag everybody, I'm Owen, I'm a Kiwi Can leader, I work at Te Waka Unua, Gilgathorpe School, Bamford, and Lindwood College. So guys, this is just a welcome back to all our KiwiCam students in Canterbury, and just to let you guys know that this is how we'll be doing KiwiCam just for the next wee while. Now our theme for this term is Taikaha, or Resilience. We have three fun challenges planned for you guys today to test out your Taikaha. But as always, before we start our lesson, we're going to do a catchphrase. So everyone, warm up your knees. And Kiwi Can says, Kiwi Can says, Koa e mate feke, Koa e mate feke, Mate ururua, Mate ururua. We'll be doing these challenges too, so let's see if you can beat us. Okay guys, our first challenge is a bit of a balance test. Now, because we're testing our balance, there's always a small chance that we might fall over. First thing we're going to do is stand next to a couch. Here's one we've prepared earlier. <laughs> now, if you feel like you might fall over, instead of falling forward, just fall back onto the couch. Oh, oh. Feel free to do this with someone at home or just try and beat us. Alright, I'm going to grab Gabby and Owen to come on over. Alright, you guys ready for our first challenge? Always. Yes. Alright, the first one is... <sighs> Everyone. Balance, standing up, on two feet. Cool, all right, easy, moving on. Next one, we're gonna try and balance on one foot this time. Everyone give it a try. Cool, again, not too hard, right? The next one is a little bit harder. All right, number three, you have to try and balance on one foot, but also bend over and touch the ground. Let's give this a try. One more time. Oh, all right, awesome. You guys might be doing really well so far. So step four is our first proper challenge. All right, what we're gonna do is we're gonna stand on one foot, but we're also gonna be closing our eyes. Now, before we give this a try, actually try and time yourselves and see how well you do. See if you can beat our times. All right, are you guys ready to give this a try? Yep. Yes. All right, one foot and close your eyes. <laughs> yes! <laughs> awesome, let's see if you guys can beat our times. Now, the last challenge is obviously going to be the trickiest one. We're going to take turns at this, and how it's going to work is you're going to stand on one foot, you're going to close your eyes, and then you're going to try and bend over and touch the ground and stand up again. Now you're going to see how many times you can do that in a row. Alright, uh, I'm going to go first, then Gabby, then Owen. Now guys, we're talking about Taikaha, so feel free to keep trying, keep practicing, and try and beat our scores, or even try and beat your own scores. Here are the scores to beat one last time. 
And Owen, if they beat all of our scores, what does that mean? <coughs> it means they're awesome. Alright guys, for our next activity, we're going to see how many times we can flip a bottle. So all you need is a bottle and some water. You want to fill the bottle one quarter of the way up. Pause the video now and go and get a bottle, some water, and fill it up a quarter of the way up. So Owen, how's this going to work? Oh, that is an outstanding question. Thank you. Thank you, Gabe. You have six chances to flip the bottle. Each time you flip the bottle and it lands, you get yourself a point. If you flip the bottle and it doesn't land, you don't get a point. Just like in our last video, feel free to play along with people in your bubble or just play along with us. game we are going to do animal exercises. I'm going to call out the name of an animal and you're going to do the exercise that matches that animal. So for this exercise Owen and Sid are going to demonstrate it for you. Bunny is tuck jumps. Frog is froggy squat jumps. Cheetah is mountain climbers. And elephant And last one is Silly Monkey, so using your balance again. You boys ready? Yeah. Alright. Three, two, one, cheetah. And frog. Silly Monkey. Bunny. Elephant. Okay guys, I hope you enjoyed those games. I know we definitely did. It's now time for some GKQs or general knowledge questions. Our first question is, what is our value for this term? That's right, resilience. Question two is, what did you have to do when Gabby called out Bunny. Exactly. We had to do a tuck jump. Owen, what does that look like? <sighs> Perfect. My question is, what is one school that each of us work at? Taikaha mean? Oh, that's right. Resilience. What is the Prime Minister of New Zealand's name? That's right. 
Jacinda Ardern. And very last one, what is our names? Bruce, Bruce, Trevor. That's right, Seddon Gabby Owen. <laughs> That's the wrong one. I'm just kidding. It is Gabby, Seddon, and Owen. Okay, everybody, that's all from us. We hope you had fun and use your resilience to improve. Alrighty, let's finish off with a catchphrase so everybody warm up your knees. And Kiwi Can says... Kiwi Can says... Koa e mate feke. Koa e mate feke. Mate ururoa. Mate ururoa. Stay safe!